Bye, Dr. Bye, Dr. Ray. Hello. We'll be starting momentarily. Okay. How you doing, Dr. Abraham? Good, Dennis, yourself? I'm doing well. Nice to see you. So look, very good, very good, thank you. No more, no more trips? Good evening. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and get started with the meeting. Sorry to interrupt. Um, today is Wednesday, March 20th. It is the Shrewsbury Board of Health meeting starting at 5.30. I'd like to call the meeting to order. Second. Do you are we still getting the echo? Can you hear Dr. Abraham? Yes. Okay. All right, so first we'll move to approve the minutes for the February 26, 2024 Board of Health meeting. Do I have so moved. Oh, second. Great. Um, by roll call, uh, Dr. Abraham, do you approve? Aye. Aye. Karen? Great, I do as well. So those are approved. Uh, next up is to review and discuss coronavirus COVID-19 update. Do we have yes. Amelia? Yes, uh, she's on the phone. Uh, to the chair to the board, I would like to ask my colleague, Ms. Uh, Amelia Halton, uh, nursing supervisor for the city of Worcester and the Central Mass Public Health Alliance to give an update. Hi, everyone. Um, so I'm going to start with COVID cases. Uh, between January and February, the cases have gone down almost 50%, and that seems to coincide with the wastewater data that is presented um, by Dr. Hirsch as well in the city. Um, flu cases seem to stay about the same between January, February. Um, We've had, a, we've had a very small flu outbreak at one of the schools, and we had a very small COVID outbreak at one of the rehab facilities as well, and both under control. Um, in light of the new COVID guidance from the CDC, we continue to recommend protective behaviors such as hand washing, wearing masks, vaccines, uh, getting tested, getting treatment, staying home when sick, because all of these apply to any respiratory illness. Um, then we have, uh, moving on to our Shrewsbury shelter. I am working with Noel Freeman, the director of nursing for Shrewsbury Public Schools, along with the SMOC team uh, working at the shelter to uh, help the state come in and finish vaccinating the students. So that is in the works between this month and next month. And then also uh, Arbor virus, I know it's a few months off, but we did have for our March topic of the month, Lyme disease and ticks, because we want to stress that as the weather gets better, people should really consider tick repellent for themselves and also for their pets. Um, I believe that's it in terms of the nursing piece, unless anyone has any questions. Is there any questions? No, nope, I don't have any questions. Thank you, Amelia. All right. Uh, next up is to review and discuss the Central Mass Regional Public Health Alliance. Uh, to the chair, to the board, I'll ask my colleague, uh, Ms. Emma, to give an update on uh, the inspectional report. Thank you. Um, so this past month for Shrewsbury, we conducted 70 inspections. We are working with our mobile food vendors to get them permitted annually so they can um, participate in more events that are happening throughout the town. Um, and then we are still addressing any food complaints that come through as well. We did have three this past month. Um, 
Indian market. Indian market was um, an issue of flies and unsanitary conditions. Um, there are some store improvements that are in the works to um, ha make get those repairs done around the store, um, and they are actively working with pest control, and they have increased um, the amount of pest, con the frequency of pest control, as well as their cleaning frequencies throughout the store, so that was pretty impressive. Um, Imperial Buffet had some issues with um, temperature holdings at their buffet tables. Their water level at the steam table was not high enough, so they took they opted to go the route of raising the water level to ensure that it's touching the pans and keeping that the food um, within proper range. So that was um, fixed as well. And then Buffalo Wild Wings, we did receive another pest complaint. We did receive one a few months back. They um, took my advice at the last inspection and they did increase the frequency of pest control. They are actively um, following through with the reports from pest control on repairs and sanitation. Um, there was no evidence at the time of the inspection of active rodent activity um, and there are there they are working very hard to um, get that under control and it seemed whatever they're doing seems to be working so that was a Good. pleasant um, outcome as well. Excellent. Um, can I ask about 9 Arnold Road? 9 Arnold Road we discussed at the last meeting um, there are unsanitary conditions at a home that was occupied by an elderly couple. Mm -hmm. um, it's still condemned, um, and I did go to make sure that it is secure, that no one um, is getting in there and we're not having an issue with any squatters or anything like that. Okay, great. Uh, any questions from folks on the call? I just had one question about the complaints for Imperial Buffet. Yeah. Have we talked about that before? Is this a similar issue with temperature? Yeah, it, 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 well, it is an ongoing issue. Um, the at previous complaints, um, they did have their steam tables needed to be repaired. Um, so that was a teaching moment with them. Um, and they did end up getting them repaired, so everything was fine. Um, but when I went for the most recent complaint of temperature holdings, some of the food was temping OK, and some of it was not. Um, it, mm, the conclusion I drew was that the depth of the pan was not mm -hmm. touching the water, so they opted to raise the water level. If that wasn't, if I went back the next day, if that wasn't the solution, then um, I told them that they needed to purchase deeper pans instead of the shallow ones, um, but raising the water level to get it to touch the pans seemed to help. Okay, thank you. Okay. Any other questions? No? All right, well, then I guess uh, we can move on to the last item, which is reviewing the meeting schedule for April. Uh, I did see some correspondence from earlier today about April 26th, 8 a.m.? Correct. We're good for that? Uh, yep. Excellent. Um, do I have a motion to adjourn? Moved. Second? Uh, Dr. Abraham? Aye. Karen? Aye. Myself, aye. We are adjourned. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.